Hey guys, what's up? By Zach Detron here from One Hive Gazette, here with the next video, and this is a live on War Day video. Gonna be catching some attacks from our war against Invictus Prime. Looks like we got a defense going on right now. Not gonna show that, of course, but uh, we, we will show some attacks. You can see the bases right here. They already scouted a few of our 10s, and they three-starred a few of our 9s, a few fails as well. We've only had one attack so far, so they're coming out a little bit quicker, but I think we're going to take our time, try to do our best with the 9s, then move on to the higher up uh, bases. We'll see if we can catch a little bit of all of that. Be right back with the first attack. All right, uh, just popped into this one. Um, not too far from when I... I've been kind of intermittently going on and off, so there might have been a few attacks between this and... Uh, in the first clip I recorded, but um, this is the first one I've been here to catch because I've been, I've been on and off uh, away from the computer a little bit. So uh, this is OWASP uh, 10 v 11 attempt. Goes ahead and quakes the, uh, the town hall right there. Might as well, doesn't need the two poisons, I guess. This is a, looks like he has some witches, a few witches, some bowlers. Probably just gonna try to come at this base um, from that uh, 10 o'clock-ish area. Yeah, there's the golem, uh, there's the bowlers behind. Just gonna storm the town hall of this base. We'll see if he can get it. The king, he dropped on the outside just to take out some trash, it looks like. The queen and the bowlers and some CC bowlers going up the gut. A lot of stuff right here, has both heroes, has the eagle, has an inferno, has probably a bunch of giant bombs. Hard to tell what's going on in there. Uh, the CC troops coming out. This is not looking good. His bowlers just evaporated in that first compartment there. Um, it's tough to know what exactly happened. Probably a combination of the eagle, giant bombs, the heroes, the CC troops maybe. Uh, all that point defense. Just a lot of stuff going on. Sometimes the bowlers can't handle it. Even if you have the freezes, the heals, and the rages uh, to try to help them out. So nice try there to Oas. Um, let's see, he's a wall breaker. We'll see how he uses this, I guess. Um, leftover wall breaker. Might as well use it to scout here, see if he can drop it somewhere, uh, maybe trigger something. But 42%, um, this one's going to have to be cleaned up by another Town Hall 10, possibly even myself. Um, I'll use my attacks a little bit later, although I have been specializing in 10v10. Looks like he got the last Tesla. That's good. Um, but yeah, 42%. Nice try to OWASP. Um, yeah, we'll back out. Nothing else going on. Uh, you can see yeah, a little bit has transpired since I last recorded. Uh, we're starting to get our attacks in, and we're doing pretty well. They are going very quickly with those scouts and already three-starring quite a few nines. Uh, I'll be right back with the next attack. Okay, uh, you can see right there we had a Town Hall 9 go in. Uh, this is Dax777. Um, I believe this is someone else playing on this account. Uh, I can never keep track of anyone because people have multiple accounts. It's too hard for me. Um, but this is someone who is, I think, goes by a different name on a different account, if I remember. I just can't remember who it is. Uh, but this is, there's not actually a person that's just Dax, I guess is my point. Uh, but let's focus on the attack, not the person here. Uh, coming in with a mass hog, it looks like. I assume there's more hogs in the CC. I don't think he'd bring any bowlers without having the golem, so probably more hogs in the CC. Looks like a triple baby dragon uh, defensive CC, and that's going to pull his queen in the wrong direction. Do you see that? She comes over to the right side there to engage those baby dragons. He did his best at the beginning of the attack, it looks like, to funnel with a baby dragon, a wizard, trying to get her to go left, but she's going to the right here. Uh, she'll get the, queen, the king taken out. Has to pop the ability. I might have dropped in like a wizard, so he wouldn't have to pop the ability. Probably could have, uh, just if he got it got it done a little bit quicker, wouldn't have needed that wizard, but uh, or wouldn't have needed the ability, rather. But um, it is what it is. He does have to pop the ability. He has a rage for her, it looks like. Um, this is just going to be all improv as he tries to adjust. Um, he goes ahead and wall breakers in, which I think is a good decision. He can get that expo, too, um, because that's an important building to grab, especially because it'll be targeting the queen the entire walk if he doesn't. She's actually going to step up a little bit here. We'll see how she goes in the base. Um, looks like she's going back towards the expo, which is good. There's the king. There's the uh, the hogs. Coming through the base here. Um, looking pretty good, I think. He has three heal spells. Mass hogs, in my opinion, is underused uh, for sure. There's all four Teslas. Boom, right there they pop. But the queen's in good shape, I think. She should stay up. She'll get that Tesla. 
Um, and the hogs are just storming through this space. This is going to be a triple unless anything too weird happens. Has that last heal, which will drop. Yep, right there. A little bit late, but so many hogs left up, it doesn't matter um, as that giant bomb explodes. Awesome stuff. The king was kind of back there to tank and kind of just everything passed him by, but he pops the ability. He'll help with cleanup, and the queen's in good shape as well. Uh, nice attack to Dax. Uh, good adjustment. Um, just keep it cool when that happens, and uh, lots of ways to get the three-star at Town Hall 9, so don't panic. Um, if you're a Town Hall 10 or an 11, that's when you panic, when your queen goes the wrong way. But at Town Hall 9, typically you don't have to quite as much. Um, but anyway, I like the hogs. Uh, good stuff. Mass hogs, always a fun attack to watch. Underused, like I said, in my opinion. Um, so anyway, we'll go ahead and back out here, see what else is going on. No other attacks. Nope, I'll be right back. All right, one second. I was just doing something here. Uh, but yeah, just jumped into this one. Uh, Tom, I'm not even going to say it. Uh, Lord of the Rings fans, I'm not even going to play into... Uh, into your game here. I know it's Lord of the Rings character. It seems like a straightforward name, but I always say it wrong and people correct me, so I'm not even gonna bother. And you can say what you want in the comments, but Tom is what I'm gonna call him. Um, coming at this base with a Shattered La Luna, it looks like. Uh, Valk, Baby Dragon CC, that shouldn't be too much of an issue for his troops, although the, the queen and the bowlers kind of split off from the king and the. Uh, the golems, which is a little bit awkward, but everything's coming together here within the confines of that compartment. Uh, queen's going to step up, take out the Teslas there. Uh, defensive queen, maybe she'll get... I don't know if she's going to get the queen there. No, not going to get the queen. This one's not looking good because he does not have anything to deal with the queen. Uh, nice balloons there for the defenses that are being tanked by the golem, but... Uh, without anything to take out the queen besides maybe some lucky lava pups or some lucky balloon drops this one's not looking good he was counting on that kill squad to get more value to get deeper but it was a little bit disjointed i think the problem was wall breaking into that junction where there's two compartments you don't want to do that you want to keep your troops together i think if he had wall breakered into one of those compartments maybe the top one his troops would have stayed more compact would have moved through the base more efficiently and would have got the value of all his spells uh, and that's not the case on this attack. The kill squad doesn't get as deep as he needed. Uh, specifically doesn't get the queen. The queen's basically the only thing left up. Uh, the Tesla, the air sweeper, the cannon probably would have gone down had it not been for the queen. So nice try, good plan. Just doesn't quite get the job done. I think the wall breakers could have been a bit better location. Um, but anyway, yeah, we'll back out make sure no one else is going in here. Doesn't look like it. I'm always a little bit paranoid that someone else will be. Uh, you can see they are really getting it done with the Town Hall 9s. Although we're having some good defenses too. They tried to attack my base already. Didn't work out for them. Um, we're going to try to get some more Town Hall 9 attacks in. Maybe some other attacks too. You guys will have to just hang out and see what we have. Alright, let's see. Uh, Dirty Dancing going in live here. Um, has a Laloon cooked up. Pretty standard stuff. Uh, probably bowlers in the CC. Um, pretty common attack that we see here. Uh, this base looks like it's already been hit once because she knew there was a troll Tesla in the corner. Balloon to take it out. And uh, here goes the golems, the queen, the wizards behind. The queen's being dropped a little bit offset. I assume everything's going to go into the little uh, inlet of the base by the mortar. I guess she's just dropping the queen up top to... Uh, to kind of help funnel, which is fine. Looks like the queen's going the right way. Wizard's behind, there's the king. Um, pretty good job on the funnel. Here's the jump, and so oh, the queen's walking. Um, that's not good. Now she might be able to get the same similar value. She'll get the archer tower. As long as she gets the defensive queen taken out, isn't the, maybe the king will grab her. I think this one's gonna be, oh, the king's down though. Um, yeah, there's a baby dragon in the CC that just went down but did some serious damage on her. Uh, this one's not looking good. Yeah, the queen is still up again with the queen. This The queen seems to be the Achilles heel of these last two attacks, at least. Uh, nice wizard on the air defense. I like that. But the problem is there's so much of this base left up. Now, she does have three hounds and a uh, considerable number of balloons, two haste and a heal. But uh, with the queen up, I, it's, I don't think the Lava Pups will get it done. 
probably going to come down to maybe a lucky balloon drop. If the queen stands next to a defense and the balloons drop a bomb on her, that might work out, but I don't even know if the balloons themselves can get through the base here, even not counting the queen. Uh, heal spell is pretty good, keeping up those balloons over the Teslas and stuff. But uh, yeah, I got some air traps popping, got the queen doing work. The expo still up, which is kind of isolated on its own. Sweeper pushing stuff back, not going to be a three star, unfortunately. Nice try to dirty dancing, good plan, I think. I uh, just couldn't quite uh, get that queen to go the right way. Sometimes it's a little bit risky to drop the queen anywhere, but exactly um, in front of where you want her to go, because she is notorious for walking the wrong direction if you give her any remote chance of doing so. So it uh, does not work out well here. Good try. Uh, looks like this one's all but over. We'll have to see if we can clean the space up. So far, not the best stuff from this live uh, video, but you know what? I'll try to catch a few more for you guys, and maybe things can start going our way. We'll have to see. <clears throat> um, uh, welcome back, guys. It is the next day of battle day. Uh, we're getting towards the end of war. Some of the, the ladder attacks coming in now. A lot of Town Hall 10v10. Uh, this is going to be the last attack I can record because I have to focus on my own attack. I have one attack remaining. First one was close, but didn't quite go my way. Uh, 10v10, didn't uh, get the three star, was close, but something went wrong. Hopefully that plan can be improved on for a triple. But this is a different plan. This is uh, Devin, um, not Smog, Devin. I'm uh, going to get that right this time because I called him Smog last time. But the NGH account is uh, Devin and he's coming at this base. I kind of helped him with the plan a little bit. We went over it, so I, I know what's going to happen. He's basically trying to get the Inferno Tower taken out. Uh, is he going to get that? Yep. So he wanted to get the air defense and the Inferno pretty much with his heroes, which is a great investment. Um, just a few wall breakers, a few wizards, and gets uh, some solid value. Very important stuff there. Uh, good job. He actually was not far from three-starring this with his Town Hall 9 account, which he used to scout it. So he's in good shape, especially with getting that Inferno, which he didn't on the Town Hall 9 attack. There's the Rage. Uh, good place. I mean, you can see he's going to drop these skellies right here. Are they on the wrong side of the wall? Yeah, they're on the wrong side of the wall from the Queen. Hopefully they can still get to her. They are under Rage. There is two of the spells. They spawn very quickly. Uh, meanwhile, the balloons are coming through. Yeah, right there. The Queen goes down. Okay, got it taken out. Money freeze. That's perfect. Perfect heal and a great haste. So very good spell placement. The balloons are looking good. Um, the traps are popping now. Let's see. The heal is kind of wearing off. Get those wizard towers. Come on, get those wizard towers. Red air bombs, flash damage, so much coming at them. Oh, they got it. They got it taken out. He's looking good here. Um, I think he has enough cleanup. There are the air skellies up. Let's see. The lava hound. Okay, good archer there. The archer draws the Lava Hound to the outside of the base. That's very important. If you know there's going to be a Lava Hound sitting there, bring it to the outside of the base um, so the pups don't have to explode it on cleanup. That can make or break the attack. The Skelly's coming around, but now this is going to be a three-star. He has too many troops left up, too much time, too few buildings left. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a triple. Awesome attack to Devin. Um, fun one to watch for sure. And uh, yeah, those Skelly's going down. He's got this. This is going to be the last attack from this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. And you guys will see the end of this war as well as the end of all the other wars in the official CWO recap. See you guys then. Bisectatron out.